Earlier today, Senator Joseph Griffo and several other local officials introduced the Public Safety Investment Act. This legislation would provide fire and police departments with access to $300 million in grant funding, which, according to Senator Griffo, will help with recruitment and retention, as well as with the purchasing of new equipment. This bill is also supported by Assemblywoman Marianne Buttonshawn, Oneida County Executive Anthony Pacenti, and Assemblyman Brian Miller. The concept is $300 million over three years, $100 million each year. 50 million for fire service, 50 million for police. Under the police grants, 75% would go towards manpower, 25% towards uh, equipment. In fire service, 75% would go towards equipment, 25% towards any manpower issues. That's after a conversation with both uh, police and fire as to what their priorities and needs would be. Uh, we'd operate this in a similar fashion. They would submit grant applications. Uh, through the state agencies, and uh, I, I believe that this will be a step in the right direction to assist them in fulfilling uh, and undertaking their duties and responsibilities. Members from the local agencies in attendance at the announcement took the time to thank these officials and further express how needed they feel this funding really is. I just want to take a moment to echo what some of my uh, fellow brothers and sisters have set up here as a Thank you, Senator Griffo, this uh, member of the Assembly and County Executive uh, for your continued efforts and support in trying to keep us competitive uh, technology-wise and uh, recruitment and retention-wise. Again, we appreciate everything. Uh, thank you very much. Senator Griffo chose to make this announcement now as Governor Kathy Hochul begins to assemble her priorities and the proposed budget for this upcoming year. Eyewitness News will follow.